What's going on everybody, it's Jack, and today I'm teaching y'all how to do some ghetto catfish hot dogs. Here's exactly what you're gonna need. Here's a quick little recap on what I have. Feel free to check that out real quick. Pause video. And then we have our $1.29 hot dogs. Really cheap, not bad, inexpensive, and great bait. All right, y'all. Here's the dogs. We're just going to cut them out of the pack here. This is kind of a learning process for the both of us. Mind you, I've never done this. It's just entertaining to watch. <laughs> nice and gross. Okay, so, got our dogs laid out here. I do have three boxes, so I want to cut these into thirds. Um, I live up in Maryland, and as y'all know, the fish up north aren't nearly as big as the ones down south. So I don't need a half a hot dog like some of y'all suggest. But uh, we're going to cut these into thirds, so bear with me. <laughs> Okay, there we go, we can kind of part these out a little bit. But here are our pieces. So now, what you're gonna to wanna to do is get any Ziploc bag, probably gallon size, is about good enough. Um, obviously open that bad boy up. And then you're gonna put however many hot dogs you wanna contribute into this bag. There we go. There's one bag. Yeah. Got our dogs here. All right. So we're going to crack open this jello. Okay, anyways, back to what I was saying. So, these hot dogs, they will sweat in this bag, right? And that moisture that they produce will actually turn them more blue. So I'll cut to this in about an hour when they're all ready to go. And these bad boys are gonna look blue as shit. <laughs> there we go. Here's a little comparison here for you. Bam. All righty, we're done. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm pretty sure it's self-explanatory, which flavors which. Um, there's our grape, strawberry, blue, shit, I don't know what it is. Something blue. Um, but yeah, these will look way better in like an hour or so, so I'm just going to cut to that. All right, everybody, <laughs> here is the aftermath. Now, it has been more than an hour. I'm not going to lie. It's been a couple hours, but these things look great. <sighs> so stay tuned tomorrow. I have a video coming out on me fishing these. But uh, yeah, this is just part one. So make sure you check out the video. I'll probably post it between a... Maybe a day or two from the update of this video. So, hope you guys enjoyed watching. <laughs>
Thanks.